Canadian raising is a vowel shift in many dialects of North American English where the diphthongs I and AU raise to mid vowels before voiceless obstruents. Generally, the diphthongs I and AU have low vowels at their nucleus. In Canadian raising, the nucleus of the diphthong changed from the low vowel A to a mid low vowel. Let's listen to the raised variants of I and AU. Five. Five. Lies, lice, rider, writer, loud, stout, gouge, couch. Canadian raising occurs before voiceless obstruents. Vowels before voiced obstruents are usually not raised. The more common pronunciation of au is articulated with the tongue in a low position, whereas with Canadian raising the tongue is raised to a mid position when the vowel precedes the voiceless consonants mentioned before. Although this phonological process is called Canadian raising, this name is not only restricted to Canada and not all Canadians share this feature. The raising of i and au is also common in some regions of the northern US, such as New England, the Inland North, Philadelphia and New York City. In the standard British English phonological dialect RP, Canadian raising does not occur.